What up, Bart here, checking in on our war. Got a awesome attack I want to share with you. Um, we're about four hours into it with Doha All Star PH. Um, we're we're kind of we're kind of railing these guys. We got eight three star, four two star, and zero one stars with zero attacks lost. Um, average destruction eighty nine point seven. Uh, four hours in, and we're 53% 53, 53 of their bases are absolutely destroyed. Um, Going to highlight a couple. Walla absolutely steamrolled his base. Super smart attack here. We got two lightning, a two lightning, a quake, and a quake. And he's got nothing to worry about as far as those air defenses are concerned. He's going to let loose... A ton of flying horsepower. I'm going to speed it up so you can watch this blanket. I watched it live. It was a great attack. We both were giggling because he's got air skelly, air skelly traps. Like, who uses those? But these dragons just march across this base <laughs> and flatten this thing. Great attack. JD with three star, you with, oh, that's me, sorry. <laughs> but we have a guy here named you. Coopier, Coopier on 19, Thunder Queen on 20, uh, Frank on 18. These are just attack after attack of uh, Leberoni on 9. Just absolutely, let's go through his. Not not the strongest, but it's a, it's a difficult setup. Uh, we're going to speed it up. Because actually, we're looking at a minute and 30 from the time he lures to the time this attack's over. So it might be fun to watch in full speed. Sets his golems in. Pekka's just go straight center. Instead of going around the outside, good heal. Got everything caught up. Rage. Getting his king all mad. The issue with this base is all these defenses are on the outside. They're easy to pick off from that secondary ring. Uh, and he just flattens that base. Awesome attack. We're going to get into a special one. I've never done this before, so it's kind of a huge deal for me. But I three-starred number two. So I'm going to pause it. Not the strongest defenses, I know. Still, a, a three-star in a Town Hall 10 in war is... It's tough, man. I've, I've had a lot of real close ones. Some 94s, 97s. You know, you just stare at your phone like someone hates you somewhere. But I use pretty much a, a lot of this attack. I mean, I, I crack open this wall on the interior uh, ring. Jump, jump. The second I put my golems down, I start to pee a little because they're all pulling right. I'm thinking, man, anything I set down to the left there, I'm going to get smoked. Golems destroy that cannon and start moving. And leaving these wizards. I'm freaking out. I'm like, man, I got to get something down to take some of the heat. Lay my wizards down. My king and my warden go right. And my archer queen goes left. I see my witches start deploying skellies. They're running center. They're doing their thing. And here comes the CC troops. Your classic uh, dragon and loons. This center is a, a, a melting pot of pain. I have to get my king raged early because he's starting to go down. Uh, he doesn't make it much longer. But that's okay. Everything comes in and just starts swarming center. I freeze that back eye tower to give him a chance to work on the town hall. And literally right now I'm like, I'm happy with two. I, I think two is going to be probably the best I'm going to do. Uh, and I kind of take my eyes off the center because generally in the center, everything dies. But there are no defenses that are reaching it. This guy has put everything outer perimeter, leaving my center to do its, to do its worst. They break through that wall. I, know, I, I notice now that I'm at 65%. I'm on that last wall of the ring, and I'm thinking, man, wait a minute. This has got some legs. I see my archer queen starting to struggle. I rage her out. She puts a lick dab on uh, the defenses on that corner, takes all three of them out before getting uh, any more damage taken to her. And now look, everything's up here just working, hand in hand. It's symbiotic. Yeah, I sometimes use big words. 
everything's working together. It's just, it's an amazing. Right now, I'm like, man, I'm at, when I hit like 80 some percent, I was like, oh my God, I'm going to do this thing. Look at my time. I got plenty of time on the clock. There are a million skellies. Look how fast they chew through this wall. Like a chop saw, man, through uh, plywood, just gone. They hit that corner. I got wizards working on it. I got skellies working on it. They get in there, and boom, that camp is gone in like a millisecond. This is it. I got two things holding me up. These these uh, skellies just are like super fast. Archer Queen, two, three, boom. 100% on a Town Hall 10. I called it when I, on my last video. I said I'm going to like these bases. I didn't realize I'd like them quite this much. But, uh, man, we're looking good so far. If we could get our, some of our other tops to hit. Um, M Ho got a 60. That's good. Leveroni killed it. Young Thrill got his two at 60. My clan is firing on all cylinders this war. I was a little I was a little worried no one was attacking right out the gate. Uh, but that's a Friday night war for you. You know, everybody's got a life. Can't get too upset with your clan for spending time with their families and having fun. But they have more than picked up the slack. Cool, I'll keep you posted on my attack on one. And the ultimate outcome of this war, which I've got a feeling, I got a good feeling, gonna be a victory. This is Bart. Deuces!